Well, guys and gals, I'm back with another one. Another one out of the box of pain from uh, Matt that he sent me. <laughs> this is one he wanted me to review. And it really, really looks cool. What's funny is I saw a video, and I think I think this might be the same guy that uh, I saw a video of a long time ago that was growing as a whole huge field of um, scorpions growing. I mean, it was massive field. Pretty sure this is the guy. I haven't researched it yet, but his name's Alabama Jack, I guess. And he's growing these Trinidad scorpions. I think it's called a Trinidad scorpion red, if I remember right. Yep, Trinidad scorpion red by Alabama Jack. <clears throat> Badass looking scorpion. I'll tell you what, mine don't get that big. My butch tees don't. I know that. And uh, I'm kind of curious how this one. It's going to taste. So, let's get this going. Figured I'd do a daytime uh, test today, something different. It's not so hot out. It's a little hot, but it isn't super bad. Oh my god, that smells strong. Ooh, nice big chunk of the sun in there, too. Bunches of seeds. Here's what it looks like. Yeah, that's what she looks like. Pretty nice. Great percent on this one side. Holy cow. I'm going to be growing uh, a nice jet going over. Sorry about that. I actually found a quiet time out here. There's anything going on, and as soon as they start filming, a jet goes over. Because I don't live too far from an airport here. Oh god, I should have gloves for this. I'm getting my hands all over this one. There's a bunch of seeds on the back of that. I, uh, I'm gonna probably grow out this one. I have a feeling it's gonna be a pretty good one. So I'm going to grow this out, and I'll grow out one from, I think I'm getting to test a pod, a pod here pretty soon from Butch Taylor, the actual straight from the source uh, Butch Tea, which mine are good and they're hot as hell, but they're not nearly as big as the ones that guy grows. Hey, look, his are just so perfectly formed, what I've seen of them, and just huge pods, blistering hot, so... I'm sure what I have has been crossed down and passed around and who knows how pure it is and you know how that goes. I get all crossed, kind of get out wild and you don't know really what you have a lot of times. Get diluted I guess is a good word. So, kind of nice to go back and get one from the source and start over and I don't know if I'll keep my overwinter this year. It's doing okay this year, but I don't know. The pods are coming out kind of small, as with a lot of mine because of the problem I had, but I don't know. I don't think I'm going to keep them. I think I'm going to start fresh. I have so much stuff to grow this coming season. Here we go. Got it out. Damn, there's a lot of seeds in there. I'm glad I didn't crunch into those babies. Oh, man, there's a lot. It's like 40, at least 40, 50 seeds. <sighs> okay. That's what we got left. <clears throat> I got some in my throat and I'm sure this will clear it out. <sighs> Boy, that smells hot. Oh, God, really strong scorpion smell. Boy, I haven't smelled that pure scorpion smell in a while. Oof, that is definitely unique. It's really fruity. Incredibly fruity smelling. I got a feeling it's not going to be fruity, though. It's going to be hotter than hell, is what it's going to be. <sighs> Okay, here we go. Trinidad Scorpion Red, Alabama Jack. Well, that pig's got some meat on it. Pretty thick. Good taste. Really good taste. Mmm. Yeah. That heat's coming. Ooh, wow. Mm. Oh. 
stuck all over my mouth. Oh. <coughs> oh, well, I haven't had a real good pure scorpion like that in a long time. It's hotter than hell. It's not like the seven pods, though. It doesn't hit you. It doesn't really hit you instantly. It was building the whole time I was chewing. And it continues to do so. But uh, it was more edible. I mean, you can, you can eat it and taste it and chew it and swallow it and get it down before you just get punched in the face with heat. And then it comes after that. Oh, man. It's burning everywhere. Under my tongue, really bad. My lips. Whew. Flavor was fantastic. Really fruity and juicy. A little bit of a... a uh, Oh, that stings like hell. A little bit of a, uh, almost like a red bell flavor. Just a little bit mixed with a nice scorpion flavor. Really kind of sweet. Holy crap, that's getting hot. Oh, boy. Oh, that's ramping up. Just steadily ramping. <coughs> Oh yeah, it's kicking. What a different kind of burn. It's just slowly increasing. Oh, my tongue and slowly getting towards back the throat, but up high, not really down there yet. I haven't really started drooling heavy yet. Oh, that'll come once. Oh, that's a different burn I haven't felt in a while. It's a little more, oh shit, I was going to say a little more manageable, but damn, it's getting bad. Mm. Oh, that's a bad burn. Oh, now it's getting there. Oh God, right at the top of the throat is so bad. Such a unique burn. Oh, really good burn though. The taste is pretty much gone now. Oh, I can't taste anything now. Mm. Oh god, the drool is really hitting me now. Oh, I'm fidgeting all over hell. full force on my throat now. Lips and tongue, but man, the throat. Throat is bad. Oh, this is right up there. Oh, sorry, I'm not talking much. I can't get the words out, it hurts like hell. sure how to describe it. Definitely different to the seven pods. It's just complete all around just throat sting. Oh, it's not even really pain. It's like a, it's more like a, uh, oh shit. It's more like a burn. Not like a sting like the seven pods. It actually feels like it's freaking burning. Like I swallowed something hot. Mm. Oh, God, I can't believe I'm swallowing that. Oh, massive drool. Oh, and a good rush. Whew. Oh, what a nice pepper. It didn't kick my ass. Woo! Oh. I wasn't expecting it to be. Oh, quite as hot as the seven pods, but. It's hot in its own way. Whew, nice one. God damn, kick ass flavor too. No seven pod flavor at all, just pure scorpion fruitiness. 
Uh, I think it's peaking, but God, it stings like hell. Massive stinging, burning, burning mouth feeling like I burned it on something, something hot. Oh, I want something to drink bad on this one. Yeah, I don't know how long it's been, but I think it's, I think it's peak. Oh, man, man. Whew. Nice adrenaline rush, too. My vision's all fucked up. Oh, Jesus. Oh, damn. That was a nice ride. Ooh, man. There you go, Matt. That's a good one. Oh, he's definitely got a good one going there, Alabama Jack. I'll be growing that. Great pod. Oh, it's starting to slightly come down now, but oh, it's mostly on the back of my tongue now. The throat's starting to move forward. Oh, still hurts in the throat, but damn, that was that was crippling for a minute there. Oh, I wanted to get up and get something to drink so bad. Well, I'm going to cut it right there. Get something to drink. I'm coming down. I'm going to go suffer a while and go to the in-laws and visit and try to get my composure back before I go. <clears throat> oh, I got drool and snot. And... Wow. I got it on my face somehow. Touch it. Touch the towel or something. Nice hot lips. Woo! Oh, that's hot. Lips are on fire. Okay. I'm going to go, guys. Thanks again, Matt. Great pod. Glad I got a chance to review that one. Take care, guys. Catch you on the next one. I'll try to do another one tomorrow if this doesn't eat me up. See you later.